Aaron, did you uh, call the meeting last night? Um, it, it was kind of a, you know, I really don't want to get into it, but it was just a mix of, you know, a couple individuals, Squid, Higgy, Kluber, um, you know, quite a few guys that wanted to talk and, you know, say a couple of things, but um, no, we, we got the message across and you know, time to keep it rolling. Did you have something specific? You've been around here and experienced very good times, very bad times. Uh, you're one of the leaders of the team now. Was there something specific you wanted to convey at such a troubling point so close to the finish line of a season? Yeah, I had a message, you know, just like a lot of guys did. But I think the biggest thing was, uh, you know, just you know, remind guys that, hey, we're still in the playoff hunt. You know, the world's, you know, the world's not crashing down on us. Um, you know, remind everybody who they are, you know, who we are. Um, you know, we're the New York Yankees. You know, it's an honor and privilege to get a chance to wear these pinstripes and play for this team. And, you know, when you're getting to September baseball in New York, that's that's where it's fun. You know, that's where all the hard work you put in the offseason, all the hard work you put, you know, grinding out those tough days in April, May, the dog days of summer. You know, this is where you enjoy it. This is where you have that push into the playoffs and, you know, go have some magic happen. So just you know, really, I think it was just about reminding you know, the team and everybody and even myself, you know, who we are and you know what we're capable of. Thank you. Tom Mary, you the next question. Aaron, what does it mean to you to come up so big on such a special night? Uh, it, it means the world to me. Um, you know, this this was for the city. You know, this was, you know, for the Yankee fans, for everybody, you know, affected on this day. This was uh, this was more than just a baseball game tonight. Um, you know, it was an honor to be able to be out there and be on that field, be able to, you know, represent New York. Um, yeah, it's, it's tough to describe. You know, like I, I said earlier, I, you know, I grew up in California, and but my, my heart and my soul are, are in New York and in this city. Marlon Rivera, you have the next question. Um, hi, Aaron. Aaron, you've always prided yourself in being a leader in this team. So how important is it to lead by example the way that you did today? Uh, I think that's the most important important way to do it. You know, uh, you know, you always want to lead by example and do the right things. And, you know, having, you know, good results always, you know, it's kind of a you know cherry on top. But I think it's, you know, more about the work you put in every single day, the preparation, you know, um, just coming prepared for every single day because, you know, this, this sport is a grueling grind. It's going to eat you up and spit you out, you know, if you don't prepare the right way and do the right thing. So, um, you know, I just try to lean on my teammates, you know, try to set a good example. And, you know, when it comes to game time, you know, go out there and, you know, have some fun and play. And Aaron, at this point, virtually, like, two games separate five teams in, in the wildcard race in the AL. What tells you, with all the inconsistency, inconsistency, pardon me, that you guys have had, that you will be one of those teams in October? <laughs> I, I could talk to you for a while about, you know, why I believe in this team and, you know, the reasons. But, um, you know, we got a great, great group of guys in that clubhouse, guys that have been there, guys that have won World Series, guys that have had long playoff runs. And, you know, I know when it comes down to playoff times, I, I know a lot of teams aren't going to be wanting to play the Yankees.